I've learned a huge amount of the programme. I think one of the most powerful pieces of learning for me was when they asked us the question, why would anyone want to follow you? So why would anyone want to follow you? And what is special about the way you lead me? That, for me, got me really thinking about what is my sort of unique selling point as a leader and what kind of things can I offer people. So it got me thinking, for example, about uh, the special skills I have, such as um, collaboration, so collaborating with other people and how important they are. And also got me thinking about um, emotional intelligence and how important it is to manage your own emotions as well as be able to read the emotions of others and just increase your own awareness and by increasing your own awareness be more aware of how others uh, feel it. I think there's um, a few areas that I'll take away, which is the, the concept of, kind of emotional intelligence and understanding yourself and your position, um, resilience, um, the capacity for reflection, which is something I do a lot in my professional role, but actually thinking about that more from the point of view as a leader. Um, that concept of self-leadership and actually leading yourself first before looking to lead others. Um, and confidence, more than anything, confidence. And absolute is just so important and it's really important that we've got plenty of people here who are prepared to invest a considerable amount of time in themselves for the future for this organisation. Uh, and it's a great organisation, but we need top class managers now and we need equal training up to be the top class managers of the future. And I think that was certainly about today in this course. Well, in five years' time, it'd be nice to be leading a service, so that's what I'm, I'd like to be, be doing. Certainly more opportunities to lead projects for the organisation and work in a cross-functional way and work with colleagues from different parts of the organisation. I think there's all sorts of things that make good leaders clear, clear and standards, uh, and uh, remembering the small things that matter to people is really, really important. I think I would say um, if you're confident in your abilities and that you um, are you're ambitious, um, I think it's a really good um, step to take. Um, it's challenging. It's hard work. Um, it's not easy to do around the day job. But if you put the effort into it, I think you'll get a lot out of it. And for me, it's certainly worth doing.